All right, episode two, NSO 22 Online, our first goal. I should, I'm saying our, as if you guys are like on this journey. I guess you kind of are on the journey with me, so. Uh, the first goal is to get into the top 2,000. In the in the past, when I've done these series, it's just always grind to the top 100. So I could actually get into the 2000s, and then from there, I think I'll be able to, in about two to three wins, get into that. Unless I can get a win on a, on a really good opponent who's got a high score. So all right, I'm one and all, undefeated. This is good. Good start. I have considered changing my team this year just because. Boston's goaltending goaltender is missing and it's their goaltender the goaltending is not very good this year in the game. Ulmark in real life, Ulmark is actually good, but even their depth past the second line, it's not super great. Uh, but the top two lines are solid, so I think I will keep them for now unless I run into some serious issues with the team. Opponents get better. They're always there. Everyone's in the know of the team to use, right? So he's the Oilers. Okay, let's go. I just hope there's a good connection. The Bruins start with possession as we are now underway. Boston's got it in the offensive zone. And that's pushed away by Puyo Yarby. Hunt's got across the blue line. Edmonton's looking to break out. Here's a short pass to Puyo Yarby. Tries to connect the pass, but it doesn't go. Oh. He's already seeming pretty eager on defense. I can tell that uh, if I can make a few changes in how I'm approaching him here, I can either draw some penalties and get some power plays or get some easy scoring chances. That's what it seems like. But we'll see. I will say he's working me right now. I don't, I don't feel overly threatened, even though he's working me. He has good stick work, I will say that. He's got good offense, actually. His eagerness is catching me right now, every time I enter. Let's go. That's big. I gotta slow this game down, make him watch that. My heart's pounding very hard right now. I think so. That's better. Yeah, I mean, he's working me on offense and I get a goal, he's gotta be a bit annoyed. Actually, my third line's not bad. I said earlier that I only have two lines, but. I would argue that I have more than that. Good first period for him, and I came out on top with the with the with the lead. So I need to get like realistically, if I can go ten and now, I'll be very happy. Because the, the first bit of competition is very it's it's not overly challenging. So. Um, like this guy's actually pretty good for my second opponent. He's actually he's actually good. I mean he's working me for the most part. His stick work is insane. Honestly. It's okay, I need an icing. He is putting a ridiculous amount of pressure on me, so. I gotta figure something out here. Slow it down or make him poke check my skates so I can get a penalty or power play or something. Pass it up for perfect six. Oh, I could have had him right there. Oh, I 
almost had that far side. Ooh, that was close. I don't even have time. He moves so quick that I don't even have time to look at my lines because I have a fear that he's going to like end up in, on a breakaway. <sighs> okay, let's focus up. Got to kill this off, right? Oh my gosh, you missed an open net. I mean... Come on, gotta kill this off. Go, 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 go. Can't, why can't I hit him? For gosh sakes, man. He's playing like a jerk. His poke checks are crazy. Man, I can't even get a pass off. Yeah, I might, I might have five shots on them, but I've taken his best, so I know what to expect. All right, he's got a lot of pressure. I got to get some openings, I think. Try to slow the game down. Yeah, I have five shots on that. I'm going to take all my time here. I got 22 seconds. Just trying to think of what I can do differently. I've missed open nets. The same guy has missed two open nets, Charlie Coyle. I mean. That's why his NHL rating for the last two years has plummeted like eight overall rating. Uh, I need to get a goal because his pressure is going to be even harder and more relentless here. His poke checks are just wild, honestly. It's just like, I can't even... Why is he not getting any tripping calls? Come on, man. Gotta get a goal here. <sighs> That's trouble. That's trouble. Go ahead and watch your replay. You know what comes next. I need to get these guys going. I can't even make passes. My guys are so trash right now. I'm just trying to get him. I want to get his blood boiling. I can't even get passes off. This is so maddening, man. You're missing open shots. Oh, Hall. For fuck's sakes, you've been useless. So close. Yeah, I mean, his poke checks are ridiculous. I don't understand how he's not getting any penalties on these poke checks. It's 
what I'm talking about, baby. Beautiful. You're a good player, but a bit too eager. Is that what I get? How is he not talking trash back, man? I'd be going off right now. Nice goal. How do you hate on it? Des I deserve that, I guess, right? I'm sick to my stomach. <laughs> What is this guy doing? He had an easiest opportunity right there. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. Feeds it to dry cycle. Against the half wall. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Well, respect, okay? He's good at opening up, so we'll see. I just don't have enough shots on that. See what talking trash does to you? Bites you in the butt every time. Not every time, but what's my heart rate right now? It's 95 beats per minute, okay? So that's that's that says something. GG's, bud. Let's go! So, what I did there, I need to explain myself, okay? I made the face-off change, pulling both of my defensemen on the backside, giving Pasternak a shot from the point there, which set up the rebound, the deflection that set up Bergeron with an open, open net to put the puck in. That's a big win. That guy was good. I can actually imagine his score was, uh, his rating is pretty high. Let's go take a look. See where that places me. Seven? So, no, he might not have been great. 10, if you get 10 or 11, that's a high rating. Okay. So, I made a defensive face-off decision because if he, he's quick. He's gonna get try to get a guy up ice, right? And if he gets a guy up ice on a breakaway, He's too good. He's probably going to score. This guy probably was better than me, honestly. So I pulled my... See how his defensemen are close? Pasternak right there, over here, could have... He, he should have been down here for a normal face-off. But I've pulled a defensive face-off, pulling him up here. I wanted that face-off puck going right to him if I win. Or setting up for a one-timer. Exactly that. So I get that one-timer. Oh, so close to him getting that breakaway, too. Okay? Just get an easy shot on net, but it deflects off of... Dry saddle is it? No, nope. Darnell Nurse. And then Bergeron, easy open net. And that's game. That is the explanation behind why I made that decision. So much goes into it. It's not just shoot the puck, hopefully you score. All right, let's check out this, uh, what rating I was given now. Episode two, another win. That So that jumped me almost a thousand rankings. So I'm one more win and I'll be right within the uh, thing is if I don't play for a bit, I'll probably play another game. I will play another game this week and post it. So if I can get that win, I'll, it'll definitely pull me below the 2,000. I thought his eagerness on, honestly, I thought his eagerness earlier on was going to give me a lot of opportunity, but his poke checks were like crazy. I couldn't get any easy opportunities. So, all right, episode two, I'm 2-0, 22,382 with a 515 rating. So I'll keep planning, climbing my competitive rating, and then I'll get lower and lower in the rankings, and that's the goal. Let's get below that 2,000, and then it's on to the 1,000. So I appreciate you guys watching today's video. That's episode two of the grind to the top 2,000, and uh, we'll catch you in the next one, guys. Take care.